What's up guys, in this video I'm going to show you guys how to download and use CCleaner and um, this can work on any windows but I have windows 10 so yeah first of all you need to open up google and type in CCleaner and once uh, you've typed and clicked enter uh, you need to click onto this one CCleaner download pure form and then you'll want to click onto download and don't do nothing it will download automatically um, give it a few seconds um, for it to download. While waiting, make sure you like, subscribe, and share this video, guys. And I hope you guys enjoy. And uh, leave in the comment section below what video I should do next. Then that would help me out a lot. So yeah, guys. Um, once it's like this, just click onto it and just run through the setup. You can just exit out of the browser. Okay, now um, whatever language you speak, click onto that. Well, I speak English, so yeah. Then click next, and just leave all of them there. Uh, make that make sure that all of them are checked, and just click onto install. Um, let it just extract the seeking the desktop and just let it install the files and everything. Okay, just click onto finish. Okay, so just okay. So now um, you'll have this. So you need to first of all click analyze and just let it find all the files and junk and that. So yeah. Once it's nearly, uh, once it's finished, I'll come back to you guys. It's just finished analyzing it. So as you can see here, analysis complete in thirty one point one. 31.129 seconds and 571 megabytes to be removed so that's around half a gigabyte uh, just over half a gigabyte so um, yeah so now you need to click on to run clean run C uh, sorry guys run cleaner and just click on to ok and let it just delete them files that are just junk okay so as you can see 574 megabytes removed in 6.082 seconds okay so now you need to click on to registry and go on to scan for issues. Click on to that and let it scan for all the issues, like all the problems in the computer. So once it's done, 100% just click on to fix selected issues, click on to no and fix all selected issues and just click close. And once you click fix all selected, selected issues, it'll take like one second and all of them will go. All the problems will be gone so yeah and don't mess around with anything else guys please don't mess around with anything else don't mess around with anything else because if you do your computer can get messed up because I know I've experienced it guys because uh, I in my last computer it was like it was a rubbish one it only cost I uh, can't remember around 80 pounds or something it was like really rubbish two gigabytes of RAM is really rubbish but um, luckily it wasn't this uh, PC Basically, I was messing around with it, so then it told me to restart it. I clicked on to yes, and then once I restarted it, it said uh, put the CD in to reinstall something, and I never had it, and it messed my computer up. So don't mess around with anything else, just follow what I did, and that's it, guys. So, yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed, and until next video, guys, peace out.